Well, there have been 22 partial face transplants, but this is the most extensive ever. A man in Virginia had injuries so severe that he actually wore a mask in public. Thanks to a face transplant, his life has now changed. His high school photograph. Richard Lee Norris graduated from high school in Hillsville, Virginia back in 1993. Four years later, this picture shows how much of his face was blown off in a gun accident. And you can see the individual as he lived for 15 years of his life behind the mask. Last week, during 36 hours of surgery involving more than 150 doctors and medical professionals, Norris received the most extensive full face transplant ever completed. Of Mr. Richard Norris, only six days after his surgical procedure. From a living donor, the 37-year-old received not only a face, but also teeth, a tongue, and both jaws. He's moving his jaws, opening and closing his mouth. He's on a clear liquid diet. He can move his tongue. He can open and close his eyes. He's beginning to feel his face. He's actually looking in the mirror, shaving and brushing his teeth, which we never even expected. For the past decade, these doctors worked in a lab, developing medical technology for full face transplants, with support from the Office of Naval Research and Department of Defense, as the military seeks ways to help soldiers that have been wounded by IEDs, replace not only their faces, but also other body parts. I have never seen anything this remarkable. The dream is finally realized.